Hello and welcome to another how-to video on VRCircle.com and today we're going to be covering how to set up your Elite Dangerous on the Oculus Rift. So before we go into the actual settings on the game here, we're just going to double check that you've got a few Oculus settings correct. So first of all, you want to go into your Oculus Rift display mode. Make sure it's set to Extended Desktop. So that is selected. Then simply go into your Windows monitor setup. Now this of course greatly depends on how many monitors you have. If I have any additional monitors set up, what I actually do is I go on and actually select them and disconnect this display. That tends to make everything work a little bit easier. So before we go into the settings of Elite Dangerous here, make sure the current monitor you're on is set to your primary and your rift in this case here is not my main display this one is okay so now we're going to close rift display mode and we're going to go into elite dangerous Okay, so once we're into the options, you go into the options menu, then go into graphics, and initially your monitor is going to be set up as primary with whatever your native resolution and your refresh rate is. So we're, go we're going to be changing the monitor, the resolution, the refresh rate, and down here we're going to be in a 3D area. The so first thing first, change this to secondary, then go down to 3D experimental, Change this to Oculus Rift, either headphones or speakers, whatever your preference is. Once you do that, this will automatically be defaulted to this resolution. And even though this shows as red, you actually can click on it and change that to 75 Hz. So you have secondary, 1920 by 1080, 75 Hz, and Oculus Rift, and in my case, headphones. Then you simply click on apply, and then once you've done that, you need to quickly look at your Oculus Rift and select OK to accept that resolution. And off to space you go. So thank you very much, and if you want more how-to videos, check out VRCircle.com.